Hello, good evening, and welcome to Gab's Drums. Two drums tonight, head to head. We have port cask. This one is a port cask, it's an Ailey, and it's a Buna Haven. This one is a port cask, it's eight year old, see if it's that one, and it's a Kokerin. It's a Kokerin. Everybody is ranting and raving about this cocaine. Um, we've got tasting notes on this. It's been matured in a tawny pork cask. Tasting notes, dried fruit, smoked paprika, cocoa powder. On the palate, smoked apple, apple wood, cheese, cranberry sauce, spiced apricot and chutney. Finished dry smoked bacon sauce, soft smoked coats of mouth without overpowering. Interesting. So, two of them are eight year olds, the two of them are pork casks. One's a Tony pork, so that might make it a bit different. It does look a bit different in colour. We've got one, I can't see yellow dot. And a red dot. So, without further ado, I'll have a wee look. So, we'll go for this one first. This is the yellow dot. And I don't know what one they are. And that's quite spicy on the nose. But that's telling me that should be spicy. So, that's spicy on the nose. Spicy. Quite rummy, raisiny, I would say. But the rums dictating it, and that's all we're getting. We're getting this spice, and we're getting raisins. But I don't know what one it is. There's no nose prick on that yellow one at all. But I don't know what this one is. So it's the red dot. Very softer in the nose. That's giving nothing away. Absolutely nothing. Sweet. There's something there. It's sweet. But no what? Slightly rummy. But sweet. Okay. So this time we'll give them a shake. Let's see if that makes any difference. That's definitely, the yellow is definitely full of spice, full of character, without a doubt. So that would be telling us, that would be that one, but who knows. Red. It's there, but it's no, that's no fiery. And it dances, there's a lot going on in that one. Right, okay, so let's have a wee noise. So, the ones, what's the strength in that? It's 56%, again, I don't know what they are. And that one's 57, so there's not much in it, to be honest. So let's have a wee go at the red one. Absolutely beautiful. If you get brought up in Buckfast <laughs> like this, it's that sweetness. I shouldn't have said that. It's that sweetness. But it's soft. Easy to drink. I'm going to have to drink water and Flush my palate out with this because that's leaving an awful lot. The things with, with port casks, you're going to get sweetness. You're going to get a lot of sweetness in them. So let's have a go. This one, 
This was the one I said yellow is a bit fiery. This is interesting. I'm going to use the word dance. The flavours in this are dancing. The flavours in this is coming out. Um, that one, to be honest, it's no dancing. The flavours are there. see the yellow is that one and the only reason I'm saying that is because that scene is all these spices and that's what I'm getting in that one so let's put a wee bit of water in them just a little bit they are 50, 57 and 56% now let's have a look in again so sweet so like you like sweet things. It's, there's no bitterness in these at all. It's just very, very, very sweet. And it covers. These are easy drinkers. People will like these. People will like these because they're sweet. The water flattens up. But the spice comes back in the back here. I need to drink water here. I can see me spilling on this. This is a red one. Okay. I'm going to be controversial here. For my power. I like the red one for my palette. The yellow one dances more. There might be more to it, but for me, the yellow one's easier to drink. I'm not sure what they are. I've got a funny feeling the yellow, that one, is that. So I'll switch them a bit. I think that's they matched. Probably no, but I think that's they matched. But as I say, for my palette, I definitely prefer the red. It's thicker. It's like drinking bucky, telling you. Okay, I'm not like me saying that. That's the sweetness it is. Okay, here we go. So, I do prefer the red one. The yellow one's nice, it depends what you're looking for. I'm not trying to get out it, I prefer that one, but that one's nice as well. And I'm a bit of having fun, but let's see. Oh, this will be, this will be completely wrong. Yellow, Kilkerran. So wrong, Gavin. Red, Puna. And I've said I prefer the Buna. Sorry guys at Kilkerran. It's the one I prefer, but I've got them wrong. And why did I think that? Mmm. I hope he's put the right colours in here. Uh, that surprises me. That really surprises me. So, let's get some glasses out and see what they look like. And remember, I favoured that one. He's not with his mum. He's got big measures with Jamie. Uh, his mum does a TV measures. She's built in the sky watching me, listening to me. Uh, right, okay. What's the difference in colour? Not really, not much. Look at the bead on them. 
oh, this one to my right has got a cracking bead on it. But the one to my left has got a bead on it, but the one to my right has got a fantastic bead on it. And that's a yellow. And that's a coquerin, because I've matched them up. Right, so that's interesting. So let's now look at them. Look at the colour of that, that's different. There is water in them. See, mind games, absolutely mind games. Now you know what they are. You're looking for different things. That's definitely nicer. That's definitely softer. That one. I'm a bit of fun. It's spicier. It's dancey. I definitely, to sit, I would rather have that one, without a doubt. But that's nice as well. Let's just put a little bit of water in them. Just to take them down. Just to waste them a wee bit. Just to see if it does anything to them. So there you go. Water's making that spicier. You know that? The water is making that a lot bit more spicier. My palate's gone. That's incredible. And the water softens that. So there you go. Two pot eight year olds. Very much similar, and that's what I like. Two of them are nice, um, it depends on what you're looking for. So, anyway, I'm going to toast you, your co-caring. Remember, press the bell, press the subs. I need subs. You'll be sick of hearing me saying I need subs. I do need subs. Um, there's a watch, and I see four guys comment every week. There's only three, four, and I really appreciate it. I really, really do. They make comments every week, and whatever I post, they make comments on it. And I really appreciate your comments, guys. Keep it up, and a big thank you to you. Cheers. Whiskeys for sharing. Whiskies for enjoying, it is dangerous, take care, slunge.